All right, hello there. Now, a lot of you guys have been asking me, how do you play the jaw harp? <clears throat> well, we're going to talk about that. In my hand, I have a jaw harp, also known as the Jew's harp, and a bunch of other names. It goes by many names around the world, but we'll call it the jaw harp. And it's a very ancient little instrument. It consists of what we'll call the frame, the outside part, and the twanger, of the little boingy inside part, also known as the feather, the tongue, or the reed. Now, when you hold the jaw harp, you hold it in your, your non-dominant hand. It'd be your unfavorite hand. Since I'm right-handed, that'd be my left hand. Now, there are a couple of different ways of holding the jaw harp. I suggest you, tr you start with what we call the two-point grip, which is, in involves your middle finger and your thumb grasping the jaw harp at the bottom like that, and then your index finger steadying it at the top. So middle index at the bottom, or yeah, middle thumb and index on the top, okay? And then you, you separate your teeth enough to bite the end of your little finger, take your finger out, put your jaw harp in, okay? So your teeth have to actually rest on these little steel bars, these little uh, bevels, all right? Very gently. Now you don't want to bite hard, you want to just barely touch, okay? And then, with your, with your index finger of your other hand, you catch that little hook on the twanger, and you want to, want to go straight out from your mouth. Now notice it's not a finger motion, it's a, an arm motion, you move your whole arm, right? Now, if you're biting too hard, it's going to rattle. Don't bite, barely touch. If you're, if you're, and you also want to tighten your lips uh, across your teeth. If your lips are open too wide, you'll get a thin sound, but as your lips close down, it gets louder. So that, that's better. Loud is good. So, stroking straight out. <clears throat> now, all the rhythm in jaw heart playing is from breathing. It's breathing from your diaphragm. Your diaphragm is a little muscle right above your belly button. Tighten up your tummy and go... <laughs> And that's your diaphragm breathing there. Like that, okay? Now you can start by blowing out and breathing in on one stroke. Out in. Then, then try doing four breaths on one stroke. Out in, out in. One stroke, four breaths. That's how you get the, the rhythm of jaw heart playing. And you wiggle your tongue, and that's where your notes come from. Kind of like that. And when you pull your tongue up to the top of your mouth, your, your notes will rise. And move your tongue more to the, toward the front and land low, and your notes will dive down. Now, a good jar harp will give you um, about 15 different notes. They're called overtones. Every jar harp plays one main fundamental note. This jar harp plays a note very close to an E or an F. It's not a, a tuned jar harp. The best jar harps are actually tuned. So your fundamental note is one specific named note. Now, this isn't um, like that, but... Let's play a little tune here. This is called the Jenny Lind Polka. It goes a little bit like this. show you another alternative grip and that's called the pinch grip and the pinch grip you 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 kind of go like this you, it's like you're waving goodbye you get your thumb up and out of the way and then you pinch the jaw harp right under your index finger and uh, at the the fleshy part of your thumb there okay and you have to leave enough room so your face can get in there and uh, and contact your teeth this is my favorite way of, of holding the jaw harp. this is the way I normally hold it when I play and the advantages to this, to the pinch grip, is that it creates a little, uh, like a little megaphone, as it were, that directs the sound outward. 
and uh, kind of helps make it a little bit louder. And this is especially helpful if you play it into a microphone because you can situate the microphone right in that little bell, as it were, and really get a nice sound out of your out of your mic, out of your plant. So, so that's uh, that's the basics of the jaw harp and. Um, Happy twanging.